hello welcome back it's me again so today we're going to be learning how to make barbecue grilled fish now this this video actually takes me back memory lane back in the days when i was in the uni i remember i used to have this friend whenever we go to their house no word of a joke their house is always crowded especially during summer and i can't help but wonder why so shortly after i got to their house their mom served me this grilled barbecue fish um, with drinks and i couldn't help but comment the fish was so yummy and juicy and so spicy just like suya it's so nice i was so i was tempted to ask the mom how did she achieve this brilliant result so I called my friend, it's okay if I ask your mom, I hope she wouldn't feel offended. And she goes, oh, why not? Speak to her. Then I went to her, I was like, mom, how did you make this wonderful, yummy barbecue fish? I said, actually, there's a few steps on how to make this and she's going to put me through. So she said to me, first, make incisions on your fish. Now, the more incisions you make, the better it is for the fish because it allows the fish to get seasoned, marinated properly. Now, before I continue, I'll really appreciate it if you can like this video, if you've le learned something from it. Um, I'll like you to subscribe, to comment and share with friends and family. Thank you. So um, she said to me, okay, the next thing you want to do is get the paste ready. Um, she said to me, um, get your scotch bonnet. Now, she said that you have to have a lot of scotch bonnet in there. Then add my curry, my thyme, my ginger, my garlic, and my onions. Then add my smoked paprika and a barbecue seasoning. Now, with the barbecue seasoning, if you're someone like me who hasn't got access to do my barbecue outside because of the type of property I live in, you might want to add quite a number of um, barbecue seasoning in there so you can get that smoky smell even from the fish like you've grilled it outside on the coal. Um, so um, add your billion powder and add your billion cube and salt if you want. Um, add them to taste okay and after doing that she said then rub it all over your fish rub it excessively be generous with it ensure that you put it in the head and the belly in those incisions you know and then put it in your grill or put it on your barbecue thing and let it grill away now if you're doing it on the smoke as you grill as it cooks keep spraying it with oil and keep you know rubbing it with the paste but if you're doing it in your grill at home you don't need to add an extra oil just keep adding the paste all over it until it is cooked okay and there you have for yourself a nice barbecue grilled fish now unfortunately i forgot to take the picture afterwards when it was cooked but trust me it is fantastic so Thank you again for watching. I hope to see your like, your share, your comment, and your subscription. Have a lovely day. Bye.